and we're going to take, that's about a little bit over an ounce of uh, the Bofin, it's Bofin um, Malisol Caviar. That's different, of course, than uh, the, the Sabruga, Beluga, Malisol that comes from a sturgeon. Okay. Bofin is a local fish. Right, Bofin is a local fish. So this comes out of the Gulf. So, you, so we're using local caviar. This, this right here, um, we're, we're gonna make it affordable to our guests. This is an item, we're just not gonna sell a whole lot of it, but we're, doing, we're trying some cutting edge things, some different, this is cutting edge, this is old, classic, very old item that we're, that we're trying to bring back. Um, and what's, what's nice about it is, do you have a little, little oil? Okay. Not this. We have some actual. What we're trying to do is kind of make make a little bit of classic turn on that. And what what it is is, we're just not going to get, especially during the economy now, for us to buy just one ounce of caviar um, from Iran or Russia will cost about seventy nine dollars an ounce. So if we were to get a thirty percent food cost, just imagine taking that and multiplying it by three. Even at 50% food cost, that's $150 for two, two people. I, I, you know, we're just not gonna have a lot of turn on that. So this, they can have a good tasting caviar. It's, you know, it tastes good. It's not as good as, as the other, but guess what? Uh, I mean, the difference in price, I think they're gonna really enjoy that for, for, the, for the price. probably need to do is maybe take one of these and have like a little brush in there. You just take it and you brush it. Oh. Understand what I mean? Then what you're going to do is you're going to take this. This is going to be easy for you. You're just going to squirt it out just to like silver dollar size. And you're going to do five of them. And you should be able to get ten on there. If there's, if you have the, the two on there, what do you think, four or five? Four is good? Okay, we'll do four. Four is good enough. That's all that thing goes. Oh, yeah, that bubble is cranking right yeah. now. It is? <laughs> I think you got that heat leak. That's nice. Huh? Yeah, we'll have to get a better one. Yeah, but for rubber, like I mean, plastic like that. Mm, no, we don't want to use metal on that. Maybe I'll have to go to William Sonoma or something to get something a little bit more attractive and smaller. Yeah. Okay, so you can you can basically see, like when these are starting to get done, they'll start to bubble. You'll see them starting to bubble like that. Just like pancake. Yeah. Can't get home. And what this is is buckwheat flour. We had a, a devil of a time finding buckwheat flour. It's just it's an old school, old type of thing that you utilize um, for for the pancakes. So let's see if we are having trouble with this thing. You can just improvise. And it would be better if you you probably. If it's a smaller, if it's a smaller spatula, it's going to be much easier. So you're going to have to kind of get through with it today. Yeah. The trick is get it in the middle. Yeah. Get in the middle. Good. You'll be able to to get it a little bit easier. Mm -hmm. And you guys can practice practice with this stuff. We've got more of it. And basically, if they do if, if they do get the actual um, uh, the menu, this is what the floral this is the the Chopin um, uh, vodka right here. And what what we've done is just basically put it in one of the the wine um, chillers that you guys have. Uh, put the the floral. Um, flowers in there, put crushed ice in there, and... Who, who's going to be uh, take care of that? We'll take care of it. Okay. But what, at this point, it's already done, mm -hmm. so you guys, all you have to do is we just put it in there, you can take it off the, the plate there, 
put it in the freezer, freezer down there. back there, and you should, you know, just you don't have it, it sitting out right. there all the time. And at some point, it's going to start melting and not look as good. Then we'll just make another one. Okay. It, does it come out of the base or get pour it with the base in it? Pour it with with the base. It's not going to come out. <coughs> and what? Hand on the ice. That looks better right there, though. Maybe not. That's off right there? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, this this right here is not going to be there. We can, all you have to do is run a little bit of hot water to get that off. But what I would do is I would take, I don't know, what do you guys, where's Michael? Where do you want the vodka to go in? The small little sh shot. Okay. Okay. And then all you do with that, I would have, you know, just like you pour, um, the wine I would have, a, a, or I don't know if you guys use the napkin or not, have a little napkin just right there in the bottom, and I would pour it out in front of the people, and then, then uh, you're you're done. But definitely don't cover, you know, just have it at the bottom, hold it, hold it, and then just pour it out so they can see the actual, you know, flower base. Okay. Any questions on this? So this is so we got the buck, buckwheat pancakes. We've got white and yellow chopped egg. We've got creme fraiche, which is basically sour cream, and then we got chives. And then we'll, you can present this in the middle for the two people, because it is just for two people. Okay. Anything else? Okay, desserts? Go for it. 